There's a couple teams left here. We got this Molly and then one other team. And we do hit the skill shot right there. Very nice. These Bruce's just gonna run away. They know the game's over. Hey, what's up guys? Got some amazing double Milo duo games for you in this video. CC is an amazing player here with him today. Let's get it. So we're starting off in the center area here, the gift shop. Find a spear and a bomb right away. Then you see that Nick's tried to take both bombs. Sorry, buddy, you can only take one. Very, very nice coordinated attack on that pepper. Bring him down. Nick's nowhere to be found. Then this pepper's gonna die too. A little icing on the cake kill right there. <laughs> this Nyx is quite upset that we killed his partner. He's gonna go down too. I'm gonna pick up these health kits. Finally grab a bow as well. We've got some new customers here. This Bruce coming in as well. He quickly realizes that he got more than he bargained for. And we're going to find a gold bomb. Very, very nice start. Now I am using double nitro. I believe CC is using the same build as me. Got double nitro, vampire teeth, and defibrillator in case anything weird happens. And by weird, I mean one of us goes down or makes a mistake, but that's not gonna happen. CC is actually insane. He is way too good. That is a lot of items and health kits in this center area. When did this happen? Gosh, we spawned here and we come back and all of a sudden, littered with stuff on the ground. <laughs> Popping that barrel there so we don't take damage from the pepper. Trying to third party. Over aggressive from her as well. You don't need to be that aggressive, guys. You're probably just gonna end up getting yourself killed as you saw there. You can walk with Milo, zoomed out, you use your bomb first, and then tap the bow after. Don't fire either of them. It takes a little bit of practice. You have to use two fingers. But as you can see, it's very, very useful. Couple teams left here. We got this Molly and then one other team. And we do hit the skill shot right there. Very nice. These Bruce's just gonna run away. They know the game's over. They know they're doomed. <laughs> I think they rotated out the other side. Now, I'm not sure what this feels like as them or as other enemies, but I would not want to be against two coordinated Milos hitting the majority of their shots. That's a very, very scary thought. All right, hopping into this second game here. It looks like we can start in the center area again. Little hesitation there, might not make it. Hopefully, okay, no worries. Surprised I got that guard kill there. Sometimes the hitboxes when you shoot right at someone on a wall, they don't really work that well. So that was nice.
right through the barrel. Proc the defib too, no worries. Yes, we could go Molotov cluster bomb. We could, but what's the fun in that? Hitting the skill shots is so much more satisfying. You don't need cluster bomb and Molotov. Oh, CC. Okay, buddy. All right, I see you. I see you. <laughs> Giving me the heart of mode afterwards. All right. Feel pretty safe walking in this big bush here. With the fire coming in, there wasn't really a high chance of like a Duke or a Bruce being there waiting for us. And even so, we would have found a way out of it probably. Look at that time to kill, so low when you're on double nitro, double milos. You just mow people down let down them really, really fast with all of the projectiles. We expect the chomp from the fin there, so we preemptively used our active. Maybe slightly missed time, but no matter, another great game. For the last one here, we're not gonna make it to the center house, but we do have a spear and a bow to start with, and a bomb and a health kit from this guard. Probably just better to eat the damage there. Save the active in case someone like this Duke rolls up. Just outside of his stun range, thankfully. We have the legendary guard as well. Later, Fuzzy. Not something you see often guys when I give someone the legendary that is a lot of respect but CC deserves it he is an amazing player and I know he'll do work with it sometimes you might have the level advantage or the GM advantage over your teammates but if they can do more work with the legendary than you can it might still be a good idea to give it to them no, I don't know if that applies here. I definitely think CC and I can make use of the legendary pretty equally, but we're both 16 and GM2 as well, so it doesn't really matter. Get out of here with your knockback.
Couple mistimed actives there, unfortunately. Kind of whiffing on this pepper. There we go. <laughs> he had a good run. Get out of here with your white flags. GG. Pretty flawless victories there. Shout out to CC. Amazing teammate, amazing clanmate, all around chill guy. Much love, man. That's all for this video, guys. Hope you enjoyed. Till next time, happy hunting. Ha <laughs> 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 <laughs>